Hey everybody, how's it going? Brian here. And today I'll be showing you a cool little jailbreak tweak called I Got Ya. Now, if you ever lose your phone and somebody tries to actually unlock the phone and you have a passcode enabled, if they enter the passcode wrong, I Got Ya will actually take a picture using your iPhone 4's front-facing camera and then it will email it to whatever email address you have set up so that you can get an idea of what the person who stole your phone looks like. And there's a couple of other features and if, if this person actually enters the code wrong twice, you can actually have it actually unlock the phone, but it goes into a state where applications will crash and you can also give it a pop-up message should they actually get into it. And then, of course, there's the usual passcode settings, so if you enter the passcode wrong 10 times, it'll actually completely erase everything on the device. So it is available in Cydia. There is a free trial, but it's $4.99 after a week or so. I'm not too sure. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and show you the settings. There's no actual application icon for it. You just have to go down to settings and find I got ya. Now it's very straightforward, these options. And you could tell it what to do. You could have it take a picture and you could also tell it to acquire the location, but you have to have location services turned on. If you have the location services turned off, it'll actually just give you a null answer. And you can also tell it what email address you'd like it to send the, the information to. And you could also prevent the person to from actually turning your phone off. And there's something called secure mode, which is what I mentioned a little bit earlier, where after two failed attempts, it'll actually unlock the phone, but it'll put everything into sort of a very minimal state where they can't even open any apps. As you can see here, it basically says that after failed twice or twice failed attempts to unlock the phone your personal data such as your text messages pictures call history contacts and more will be hidden until the person can actually unlock the phone properly and you could also have it show a little, little pop-up message and you could tell it what you'd like so i'm going to go ahead and demonstrate this i'm going to lock my phone now i'll just take my water bottle and hold it up here so when it actually takes the photo it will just show my water bottle so I'm I'm gonna enter my passcode incorrectly on purpose so I just did that now I'm actually gonna go and get my iPad and go check my email and after about five seconds after a failed lock attempt you should receive the email um, I have my iPad on the side I'm logging into Gmail and you'll see the photo that it took. So, here is the email. It's coming from I got ya. It says device unlock failed. And you can see that it says null, but I'm assuming that if you have location services actually turned on, it'll give you the coordinates of where the person was when they tried to unlock it. And then of course you can view the full sized image. And there is my water bottle that I took a picture of, and there's my camera. So it's a really cool tweak. Is it worth the five bucks? I would say so. Five bucks is a little bit, it's just a little price to pay when it's, it pretty much allows you to quickly find the person who's actually using your device if you lost it or if, or if somebody stole it and they don't want to give it back or whatever. It's a very, it's a pretty cool little thing to have onto your phone. Now I'm going to go ahead and show you secure mode. So I've already entered the passcode wrong once. So if I enter it wrong one more time, it should actually unlock. And we are going to be into secure mode. You can see all my folders and stuff in the background. Those are actually going to disappear right there. And this is pretty much the stock home screen layout almost. And here's the message that I told it to put up. Uh, I told it to please return this device to the original owner, you bastard. And you can push OK. So if you want to go back to the normal mode, you just have to go in and enter your passcode properly. Oops, that was completely wrong. So let's try it again. And you can see that it's exiting secure mode. And you could actually see some of the other pictures that it just took once I enter them incorrectly right there. So now if I enter my passcode properly, it'll go back to my stock interface and all of my apps are there. Everything works just fine. So it's a really cool tweak. If you, if you, if you often lose your stuff, then this is great for you because you can easily figure out who's using your phone, who's trying to unlock it, and where they're actually located. 
but that's assuming you have internet enabled on your device. If you don't have 3G or Wi-Fi, then you, you're pretty much screwed. But overall, pretty cool tweak. I like it a lot. And that's about it. So if you have any questions, comments, or suggestions, you can leave them down below in the comments area. But that's it. So thanks a lot for watching, and I'll 